Okay, I had posted a video here uh, a couple days ago when I was repairing this uh, coil winder that I bought. And um, one of my subscribers, uh, Ray, he uh, mentioned that um, the foot pedal um, changes the speed just like a sewing machine and that if I was to put a dimmer switch in line with it that I could uh, slow it down even more so I do know that the foot pedals are rheostat and so is the uh, the dimmer switch so I guess it puts more resistance in line so uh, yeah, I said why not? I was at, and it's kind of funny because I was at the, at a store and uh, there was one there for three dollars and I decided it was brand new, in the package. So I decided to pick it up and why not try it? You know, if any of you people want to, uh, any of my subscribers or anyone wants to make a suggestion on the comments, I'd be more than happy to consider them or try them and yes he was right right now oh I just put a little flag on it there so a visual aid so right now it goes quite fast and you can you can lower it down quite a bit but I can I can hear the motor it's whining because it's not getting enough voltage. So, yes, it, it definitely does slow it down. And you can slow it down, speed it up. But I can tell by the whining of the motor that uh, it's, it's definitely not getting enough voltage and it actually could heat up that motor. Well, I, it all depends. Well, there's no real load on it right now, but if there's a load on it, it could heat it up some. So, yes, it does work. It does work. But um, I, like, I like this idea. But I might do it electronically by using a pulse width modulator and... Um, hooking up to a MOSFET and controlling lowering the speed probably even more by uh, control, controlling a MOSFET and the switching of the AC voltage through a MOSFET I might uh, I might try that so yes Ray it was a great idea it was a great idea it works and if anybody has something similar to this, uh, I think he had mentioned a sewing machine. It It's roughly the same idea as a sewing machine. So if somebody wanted to uh, slow down their sewing machine a little bit more, they could do this. They could uh, put uh, AC dimmer that you would have in your house. It's just, it's just an AC dimmer, right? Uh, anyway, yeah, yeah. If uh, anybody wanted to do, do that with a sewing machine, it would work the same way. But the humming to me means that the motor's not getting enough voltage. So I think I might build a circuit to control this a little different. And. Uh, because, yeah, I can hear that motor. I don't know if you can hear it. See, let me turn it up. Now it's at raid speed and raid voltage. And obviously you don't get that hum. That hum will uh, 
that it means that the motor's not getting enough voltage and it's laboring and if you put a load on it it's probably going to heat up and I don't want to burn out the motor so I'm going to have to go a different kind of a different route with it I guess it all depends on uh, now if I had a slider a slider would be much better because a slider, you could ha you could do it low when you're first starting off, and then if you want to just push it up quickly, you could just push it up and then be at the rated voltage. Yeah, I think I think in this case, a slider might be better. So again, if anybody wants to subscribe or comment on my videos you're more than welcome I read all the comments and I in most cases I will reply to you have a great day cheers